For almost two weeks, some 120 Yazidis have been sleeping in the street, refused entry to a camp in the north of Greece. It houses most of the Yazidi community in the country. Until recently, hundreds had sought shelter in Greece and there had been dozens of asylum seeker housing. But authorities have been shutting most of them down after protests from local communities. The Sarez camp says it's no longer taking any refugees, citing capacity problems. Greek officials say they are prioritizing women and children. We have been here for 12 days, tired, cold, hungry and without a shower. We are asking the European Union to find a solution and to find a place for us in this camp. The Yazidis belong to a Kurdish-speaking minority. In 2014, thousands fled massacres committed by the so-called Islamic State in northern Iraq. A special UN investigation last year found evidence that a genocide was being committed.